can take you anywhere, somewhere. We won't be scared. Hello, and welcome to today's living room clean and organized with me. My name is Ashley for those that are new here, and I post all kinds of cleaning motivation, homemaking motivation, cleaning, decluttering, organizing, all the things in between of keeping our homes happy and tidy. And so if you are new here, welcome for the first time. I'm so excited to have you. And if you are a repeat viewer and coming back and are already a subscriber, welcome back. Hey girl, I am missed you. How are you doing today? Today. Let me know what you guys are up to in the comment section and let's get to work together. Okay, my internet fam will know I have been wanting one of the IKEA sectional couches for a bit now and you guys they finally had one in stock at our local IKEA and I snagged it like quick as I possibly could. Fingers were flying, but I finally got it. So we are in the process of kind of cleaning, organizing and just resetting up our living room with our new couch. For those of you that may be in the market for picture frames, wall decor, just decor in general, I highly recommend checking out Ross. They have had so many good things lately and the picture frames that I just showed you in the previous clip were literally the most expensive one and the biggest one was $12.99. Like it was a steal of a deal and totally worth it in my opinion. And so if you're in the market and you are wanting something a little more budget friendly, definitely check out Ross. I'm really excited about those though, you guys, because we are going to be putting them up over the couch there over the like the left side of the couch where you can see there on the screen right now and so that is going to make it so much homier and I'm just really excited about that I know for some people it's a little traditional to just put picture frames on the wall and you want like art and all of these other things but for us that's what we're excited about and it's going to make it so much cozier to me For those of you that are wondering, yes, these are all of the like shelves and things that we had put into our guest room that was previously like our guest room slash playroom, but with more family coming to visit this summer and just lots of things going on and needing places for people to stay and just various reasons personally, um, we are moving this out here and that way I can also access the girls a little easier when they want to sit and play with their toys. I'm not having to like take them in another room and watch them on the monitor if I'm having to like leave or like try to make dinner while they're trying to play at this same time it makes it a little bit easier for me to kind of keep an eye on them because with a toddler and a baby someone's going to end up crying before the play session is over let's just be real here if you have little kids then you completely know what I'm talking about somebody's going to end up in tears but this will help me be a little bit more accessible to them and kind of make sure well you can't mitigate that and make sure it's not going to happen but it will help at least a little bit hopefully
toy organization, this system has really worked well for us and the cubes and then not having them full of like baskets and then all of that kind of thing. We just put the toys on the shelves. So it's kind of a little Montessori-ish. I'm not gonna say full on Montessori because that is like, I'm not fully committed to that, but we are doing a little bit of that. And this really helps to have everything have a place and everything can go back in its place. When I'm having my girls help me clean up, um, my toddler knows exactly where things go. So when she gets out her little people, she knows where the little people go. They go back on that particular shelf. When she goes and gets her car toys out or her balls, they go back in the ball basket. And so she knows where things go, which makes cleanup during the week when we're going through our routine a lot easier. And so I can definitely recommend that. I have lots of different organization pieces that I can link down in the description box. So if you guys are interested in checking that out, I always think it's fun to like see what other people are using and cleaning with and organizing with. And so I am a total nerd for that stuff. So I will have those linked in the description box for my fellow organization nerds. And another thing I picked up recently to kind of refresh our room is these lamps. I got two of them, one for here, and then you'll see me set up the other one in just a bit. But I was so excited to find these. If you guys have a store called Dirt Cheap near you guys, you need to check it out. It's like a liquidation return store for like Target and just a bunch of random different stores. These lamps actually I saw at Target just the week before for $44 a piece and I ended up getting them at Dirt Cheap for $16. Now I will say this is the dirtiest, nastiest store. My husband calls it a dig store and it just 100% stresses him out. And so he is giving of himself when he goes with me. He's like, I do not like this place. It just, it stresses me out to no end. But I really like the good deals and so does he. He does like when we save the money on things. So he is at least appreciates that much but I was really excited to find these and I even found one of the lampshades that at Target was selling for $22 like you guys $22 for a lampshade just feels really expensive to me I'm sorry especially after you've paid $44 for the lamp but I digress I found this one for a dollar there were a couple little dents in it but I just was able to turn it to where the dents were like against the wall and I have a lampshade for a dollar and my room looks completely new and I'm so excited about these. And I'm just adding this little wicker basket that I found at the Target dollar spot for $5 and then putting just some tissues in there. And then this basket I found at Home Goods for $19.99, which I thought was amazing for like this size of a basket. I was really impressed with that deal. And so I'm just folding and putting all of our blankets in there and throws. And so that's how the room turned out. I am really, really happy with it. And now obviously there to the right, you can see our old couch that we ended up selling on Facebook Marketplace. So that was a Able to go to a new home and it was so sweet the girl was absolutely thrilled she was like it's my first place and I'm getting this couch and she's like I'm so excited and so it was just like I'm so happy to see somebody else get some love and enjoyment out of it our family has made a lot of memories and so it was nice to see it go to somebody else that can enjoy it but yeah that is going to do it for today's video I hope you guys enjoyed cleaning and organizing along with me if you did be sure to hit the thumbs up button and hit the red subscribe button again if you're new here and join the internet fam and I will see you guys back for another video. Bye you guys. Have a great week.